Tappy activated. It's time to upgrade our knowledge on proof of stake. Instead of miners, proof of stake blockchains have validators. Validators are selected based on the amount of bet or stake on the network. The bet serves as a guarantee of the validator's honesty. Validators check transactions to ensure that transaction signatures are correct. They comply with network rules, and all transactions in a block are valid and consistent with previous blocks. Then, after verification, block formation occurs. The validator creates a new block that includes the confirmed transactions. The block is added to the blockchain after verification. In POS, validators can also use voting or consensus mechanisms to confirm a new block. After that, the state of the blockchain is updated to include new transactions and changes to account balances. Being a validator is a big deal. It requires technical know-how and a hefty chunk of crypto. For example, on ETH2, you need to stake at least 32 ETH. And if you mess up, like going offline or validating a bad block, you could lose some of your staked funds in a process called slashing. Not ready for that level of commitment? You can recalibrate your thought protocols for optimal decision-making and still get in on the action by joining a staking pool where someone else does the heavy lifting and you earn rewards for your crypto. Let's take another break before comparing these two systems. Tappy deactivated.